So yeah, I've been, uh, this is actually kind of fun to look at. I was, uh, checking this guy, uh, free shout out to him, Dre Dreary, something like that? D-R-E-Y-R-I. Um, he has gotten, um, 202 million experience in, uh, total this month. He got from 80 cooking to 200 mil cooking this month. So, that's, like pretty impressive right there um he must have been planning this for like the longest time just to get on like the uh high scores because he the highest person even close to him is like half his experience so that's pretty crazy so congratulations to him i guess that's quite insane getting 200 mil experience in basically a month he got pretty much from one to 200 mil cooking in a month more or less so I mean, how many hours is that? That's probably like a thousand. That's, well, I guess sharks are about 230k an hour. If he did, like, the whole, like, cooking, like, cook five, like, first two that you cook and then cook some more, it probably would have been, like, 250 to 260k an hour. So that's still, what, 200... I don't know why I'm even bothering, but it's a lot. That's probably, it's almost a thousand hours this month, so... Kudos to him, I guess. Uh, hey guys, what is up? Next day, and bam, 84 Slayer, 83 Defense. That's awesome. I want to show you guys something. Spiritual Mages, I've killed... 640. Gotten two boot drops. So, I'm due to get like four this task. That'd be cool. At least, you know, because like... It's supposed to be like a 1 in 125 chance or so. And I've killed 600, gotten two drops. So, I'm getting like half the drops I should. I should get at least three or four, maybe even five this task if I want to actually keep up with the drop rate because I got 145 more. I've already killed 59, haven't gotten anything, so. Yeah, these spiritual mages that I was so looking forward to, I'm not really uh, not really digging, but you know, really close kind of close to 85 slayer, or 80 yeah, 85 slayer, so. Then I can go ahead and just have my jolly time camping abyssal demons until... 99 strength, and maybe even until like 90 defense, just for something to do, because it's like super simple and super good money. Like, um, depending on how fast I kill them, I'm guessing it should be like around 400, 500k an hour or so. Uh, it shouldn't take more than three hours to get a whip, is kind of the way I look at it, because you're getting 100k experience an hour, let's say, if you're using Darok. Uh, each one of them gives you 60, so you can kind of do the math there. I mean, it really shouldn't take all, or it, each kill gives you 600, excuse me. Um, so 600, you know, you're getting 100k an hour, so you, you do the math. But um, it shouldn't take more than two, three hours to get a whip, so divide that by three or two, somewhere like that. So it'd be around like 500k an hour, because you're pretty much breaking even off of all the other drops. So yeah, it'll be good money, nice and AFK, good experience, and it'll be fun, I guess, kind of. I'm sure I'll get bored of it after a while, but yeah. So, I'll see you next clip, hopefully with like five dragon boots in my inventory, that'd be nice. Also, shout out to this guy, he's like the happiest runescaper I've ever met. Hey man, I thought he was someone on my friends list or something that I deleted or something, but no, he's just the happiest runescaper in the world, so shout out to him, OSRS Kyle. He's probably high right now, oh, he, okay. That guy was person of the year. If you're watching this, Kyle, I salute you. Yeah, there we go. Last last one to kill. Got one pair of D boots, so I guess I'm kinda happy, but yeah, I definitely uh definitely deserve more. This mage dropped like three pairs right in a row. If this was EOC it probably would, but it's not. Okay, Chaos Runes. That's close enough. You know, let's just I always like killing one at the end for good luck. I don't know why, I just do. It's piety it. There we go. Oh yes. This one's gonna drop D boots, I don't even care. I'm calling it. I know it. Two hundred five. Lucky number. Bam, D boots. I will uh I'll go ahead and edit the video, put D boots there. So then I can get on Chris Archie. Although I wasn't screaming loud enough, so I don't think I'd get on Chris Archie. You gotta be screaming obnoxiously loud at the top of your lungs, you know, if you wanna be able to get on Chris Archie. It's gotta be so loud that anybody who's watching the video has to like turn off the video because it's so loud. Um <laughs> I've no, nothing against Chris Archie, but the quality of some of these clips is negligible at best, so whatever. I will uh, 
see you guys with whatever. You know the drill. 84 defense. Yay. Ah. Uh. Alright, so we are 51k until 85, so it's probably, if I get lucky, two hours, more realistically, about three hours till I get my level, that'll be awesome. Um, I've been kind of slacking, I took a break, I guess, over the weekend, just to kind of chill out and do stuff. I was kind of getting, like, super burnt out, and uh, I didn't want to, like, get burnt out to the point where I wasn't going to play for, like, a week, so I just took a break. It's take breaks occasionally from RuneScape. Uh, it'll overall improve your efficiency, honestly, because you'll have the motivation to keep playing. So, um, My plan here is, I actually uh, checked on Zybez, and uh, Guthans is going up a lot. It's like 9.2 mil right now, or so. So, uh, I'm going to sell my Guthans, and buy full Darok and a Berserker Ring, and then trade in 99 Strength at uh, Abyssal Demons, hopefully... Uh, Guthans, the spike will go back down, and I can buy it back for cheaper than what I sold it for, so that'd be nice. And then I'll head back to Slayer once I get 99 strength and have some bank. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to spend it on. I'll probably take a break from Slayer, actually, at 85. After I camp those uh, Abyssal Demons, I might um, train some Fletching, I was thinking. Like, buy just a crap ton of logs with the uh, money that I make from the whips. And then um, sell those back for a little bit of extra cash. And then, okay, test them. And then, uh, yeah, and then go back to Slayer with hopefully even more money. So um, I might use some of the money to get prayer up to like 80 or something. I think 80 prayer is like 10 mil, though, so I don't know. Um, we'll see. I'll see you next clip with maybe 85 Slayer. Who knows? Um, <laughs> um, I am a happy man. Some guy came through here in full Guthans, and, um, he died. It's a poor soul, but that's like 10 mil worth of stuff. Holy crap, that's like 15 mil worth of stuff. Well, I am a very happy man today. I'm gonna hop worlds so that he doesn't, like, come begging for his stuff back and make me feel sad. And I don't feel like a bad person. I mean, he was running through the abyss. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm a happy person. Wow. That's going to pay for a lot of stuff. Holy crap. Thank you. Thank you, random guy. Awesome. Oh, look at that beautiful money. 14.3 mil. I am happy with that. Um, I kept the Berserker Ring for myself. I was going to buy one for uh, Full Derek, But I think I'm going to spend this on... This, this will actually work out perfectly. So here's the new plan, I guess, now that I got this. Um, I'm going to go ahead and... Um, Buy full Darok for training strength once I get 85 Slayer. And then I will buy a Zamoranki and Hista. Just because. And then I will use the money that I have left over to get 80 prayer. That, that'll that be awesome. So the 10 mil that I make... The uh, 10, 15 mil roughly that I make from um, Camping Abyssal Demons, I will put into prayer. Get it to like 80, 85 maybe. Um, and then I should be good to go. I'll start getting Abyssal Demons for tasks, and yeah, this is, I'm liking this. That's awesome. Um, it's not awesome for the guy who died, but he was wearing full Guthans at Aberrant Spectres, so I don't know. I don't know what he was doing exactly, but uh, I'm going to stay here a little bit longer, try to buy myself full Darok, and uh, try to buy myself um, perhaps a Zamorak in Hista. I might just buy all the prayer potions that I need to get 99 strength in one go perhaps. I mean, I'll have enough left over from that, so. Awesome. I'll see you guys next clip with most likely 85 Slayer, for finally, after teasing you for so long. There we have it. Nice 65 mil stock left over. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much everything that I really wanted to get. Um, I don't really know what else I want to buy with this stuff. I mean, pretty much all of this is going to be going into skills now, so. it's awesome. I'll probably use all of this on pre-pots, honestly, just to have a nice stockpile of them. I could buy like 500 with that. That should be enough for 99 strength easily. So that's awesome. I can't. I can't stop saying that. that that's awesome. I love this. I love this game now. Samurai and Hasta. Look at this thing. Oh, I need to know Barbarian Hasta skills. Whatever. I'll do that later. Whenever I want to. I'm not gonna show you my bank pin. No. Go away. 
Oh, guys, here we are. We're uh, 400, exp 400 experience away from 85 Slayer. It's awesome. I can't wait. I got a Rune 2 H sword. Yeah, let's, let's just take a moment and marvel at that. I don't know. Once the best weapon in the game. That's, that's crazy to think about. At one point, the Rune 2 handed sword was the single best weapon in all of RuneScape. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm about to get this level, and I'm, I've been, I don't know if it's just, like, my OCD or something, but I've been terrified, uh, I'm planning on camping Abyssal Demons with full Darok, as you know, I've been terrified, like, what if Jagex trolls me and gives me an evil chicken? Like, like, just think about that for a second, because I'll be protecting melee, so, Abyssal Demons, no problem, but... What if I get an evil chicken, and what if he hits a three on me, and what if I die and lose all my stuff? So, that's been like scaring the crap out of me. I don't know. If, I don't know if I'm just being paranoid because I mean, plenty of people have Darocked abyssal demons. Maybe Jagex has. I mean, I don't think I've even gotten an evil chicken while I was in combat yet. I've gotten like Mr. Hyde and stuff, but they don't hit through melee prayer. I don't think so. Um, yeah, I don't know. That's that was just something I was thinking about. I'm like so terrified. Alright, here's the lucky fire giant. You, sir, I love you. Oh, 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 ah, uh, ah, uh, take a screenshot. Stupid Jagex, why does that do that every time? Can never get a screenshot. Whatever, I can kill Abyssal Demons. I'm done, I'm out of here.